Street. Just as it seemed the visitors had got enough players back, just in time the ball was worked back to Tony Vilhena, whose shot flew in off the boot of Azo Matasiwa. The young midfielder, unknown from Ajax, avoided an own goal. Vilhena's shot was heading in any way. This was exactly the breakthrough they'd been looking for. But this was as much as they managed before half time. This one was the first of two in just over two minutes that secured the win and led to a performance much improved from last week's second half when they've thrown away the lead to lose at Rotterdam Rivals Excelsior. Calvin Fadon getting his first Eredivisie goal. And meaning there'd be no debate about whether Van Persie should have had a penalty. The left back found himself in the perfect it was the inability to clear their lines which cost them in the end as another player got a ball in the face, Delana Bergsuk. Jordi Klasi nipping in to set up the goal. A second of the season for the young defender. He's had a number of up and down displays of late. This was in the former category. And it served to calm any lingering nerves from last week. Klasi proved the man again as they added a fourth to seal all three points. Trying to play out from the back proved a mistake for Degrowska, who lost out once more to the little midfielder. Prior to this game, Jens Tornstra had scored against every Eredivisie side he faced, at least twice, but never against these visitors. That header meant he finally had his goal, and a sixth of the season. The game was now all but one, although the... ...and was himself bound by a great long ball. His cross was then perfect for Malapa. He'd lost his man and had the simplest of headers. The Togo strikers learned from Dinamo Dresden has been a great success so far. He'd scored goals at each of the top three levels in German football and he's now doing it regularly in the Netherlands to keep Vey 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 on track for a place in the end of season Europa League playoffs. set this one up for Noyen himself was the man on the spot for his side's next big opportunity in the early stages of the second period with the penalty soon after when yet or promise was judged to have tripped substitute Evangelos Pavlidis it was a direct run from Villantre's other Greek forward but it also looked a soft decision promise half dangled a leg out and the most was certainly made of minimal contact Up step Crowley to convert the opportunity and register a fifth goal, his best ever total in one season. The momentum shifted back in their direction as chances then came along to finish off the job. Minutes before for just his seventh senior appearance. While he carefully brought the ball forward, things were moving ahead of him. And Fanoyan was seen providing a second assist from Lapper's second goal. Simple football, but very effective from a side who continue to punch above their weight. They're now level with Heracles and Utrecht, sitting in between the two in the Eredivisie table. But they'll face a big test away at RZ this coming weekend.